Laura Park and Debbie, having officially become a couple, now go on a date in public for the first time. So how did your parents take your coming out? They are split over the issue, literally. My father refused to accept the Baptist Church becoming Unitarian Universalist instead and left it, along with a dozen others who call the rest of us traitors. And of course, he doesn't accept me being lesbian. But when I told my mother about it, she hugged me and said, Honey, I loved you before and I will love you forever. The next day she kicked my father out and filed for divorce. I'm sorry, it seems some people are just too set in their ways and don't want to change because it is too painful for them to admit they were wrong. Indeed, my father was himself the nephew of a Baptist minister and said he couldn't imagine everything his uncle preached not being true. But that's his problem. I just want him to love me again. Oh no. Ah, hello. Hey, Carrie, come join us. And then a memory flashes in Laura's mind. You think you can insult Almighty God and get away with it? If there is no God, then no one was insulted. And if he is so almighty, why do you claim to speak for him? Have you even seen God? See, you idiot, even your God cannot hurt me. You have to do it for him. And I can hurt you right back. Carrie? Did Debbie invite you here? Yes, she did. She wants me to get to know the new version of you. She said you had changed. You seem afraid of me. Why? Aren't you angry at me for stealing Debbie from you? And for beating you up in the school restroom? No. Debbie is not a piece of property and before she even hooked up with you, she told me about you. And I am okay with her loving you. And as for what happened two years ago, I'm over it. You are a better person now and I forgive you. It seems everything I was ever told about atheists was wrong. You have a beautiful spirit, Carrie, just like Debbie does. You know better now and therefore, you can be better. Let us all walk the path of enlightenment together.